assuming that alpha is 25 degrees, determine the tensions in cable AC and AB. This is a typical two-dimensional equilibrium problem. The first step is to read the problem. The second is to draw a free body diagram. What are you going to draw a free body diagram of? Point C is our point of interest right here. There are three forces acting at point C. The 5 kilonewton load produces a downward force. The tension on the rope at B, at alpha below the horizontal, and the rope going up to A at 5 degrees from the vertical. These are your forces. The next thing to do is to write each of the forces in Cartesian form. So if we write A is minus A sine 5i, because it's in the minus i direction, plus A cosine 5j. B is minus B times sine alpha j plus B cosine alpha i. Notice that since the 5 and the alpha are with respect to the horizontal and the vertical, if your sines line up, then your ij's don't. And the last force we have is just minus 5j kilonewtons. Once you have your forces in Cartesian form, you can write your equations of equilibrium. Sum the sum of the forces in the x direction has to equal 0. The sum of the forces in the y direction has to equal 0. So, to sum the forces in the x direction, add up the i's. We have minus a sine 5 plus b cosine alpha equals 0. Add up the forces in the j direction, you have a cosine 5 minus b sine alpha minus 5. Don't forget your weight equals zero. Those are our two equations and two unknowns. The next step is to solve them. So if we take that first equation and solve for A, A is B cosine alpha over sine of 5. Now remember, alpha is given, alpha is 25 degrees. That was given in the problem. So this is B cosine 25 over sine 5. And if you pull out your calculator, you can show you can show that A is 0 0.78990 times B. Once you have A in terms of B, plug it back into the second equation. Plug this into the sum of the forces in the y direction. Cosine 5 times point O. 78990B minus sine 25B minus 5 equals 0. That equation can be solved for B. B is 0 0.503206. Once you have B, plug it back into your equation that you just had right here to find A. A is 5.2326. Now that you've solved two equations and two unknowns, you can actually go to answer the question. The tensions in the cables, AC, AC is the cable that went from A to C, which we called A. AC is 5.23 kilonewtons. And AB is 0 0.503 kilonewtons. Last step, of course, is to make sure that it makes sense. If you had a crane holding up a 5 kilonewton load, would you want the vast majority of the force to be carried by the crane? This is the crane. And in fact, that does make some sense, that you are pulling a little bit out and down. This is a smaller number. This would be out and down. That means that the extra bit down has to be also covered by the crane. And this is a reasonable set of numbers for your answer.